drivers run to their cars at the start of the greatest sports car classic of all, the Le Mans 24-hour race. Arrangements for the huge crowd have been much improved this year to prevent any repetition of last year's tragedy. British Jaguars, Aston Martins and Coopers are prominent from the start. But two Jaguars driven by Frere and Fairman and the Potago's Ferrari come to grief early in the second lap. Number 51, a Panard driven by the Frenchman Louis Erry overturns and burns out. Erry is fatally injured. But though there are several crashes, all the other drivers escape. Jaguar number four, Ron Flockhart and Ninian Sanderson is well up among the leaders. The field thins out steadily as night falls. The rules of the race only allow refueling every 34 laps. With two hours still to go, only 14 of the 49 starters are still on the road. Seven of them British, including Flockhart and Sanderson's off-the-peg Jaguar. And it's these Scottish amateurs who bring off the great prize. Their Jaguar roars home 10 miles ahead of Moss and Collins' Aston Martin. And six of the first eight are British cars.